So, we're here again, first round again, had four few in a row. Northampton, how do you think that game's going to go? Yeah, it's going to be a tough game, isn't it? Um, you know, like you said, four years on the trot is a, is a great achievement. Um, and, you know, Northampton's, they, they, they're used to winning, obviously getting promoted last year, and it's going to be a tough game. Um, it, we're under no illusion to that, but, you know, we're, you know, we're, we're confident at the moment. Um, we've got to concentrate on ourselves, we've got to make sure that we've performed as best we can. If we do that, we, um, we stand ourselves a chance of, of getting through, but, um, you know, we, we will concentrate on them a little bit, but um, we've got to make sure that, you know, we do our things right ourselves. I was just going to go back to your FA Cup record whilst being at the club. Is it 18 played, three defeats, 13 wins. I mean, that's a remarkable record, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It is. It's something to be proud of. I think, um, you know, a, f a football club the size of Ox Oxford City, you know, they, we, uh, the club rely on financial stuff and um, the FA Cup's a massive part of that. So um, to win the games that we have done, um, you know, it's a massive credit to the football club. But, um, you know, now we're, now we're here. Um, we're at the first round again and, and there's another opportunity to get into the get into the next round, that's what we're trying to do. Have the, have the lads been getting in the barbers before lockdown just to make sure they're, they're sharp for the telly? I think so, yeah, I'll see if you're in a minute, uh, whether they have or not, but I, I'd imagine they was in the barbers last night till, till late to make sure they've got their hair cut. Um, yeah, a few of them will, will want to look good on the camera, that's for mm. sure. What's it like when you're playing at this level and it gets selected for live telly? Um, you know, I, I think as the players in the changing room, they've, they've played on TV before. Um, it's an added bonus, but um, you know, when we come come kick off time and we're out there playing for for the next round, um, I don't think many people think about it. To be honest with you, uh, we just want to get into the next round. When you get on that on a roll like you have in, in recent years, do, does it does it help you keep that going? You know, in a sense, in terms of you, you know, you, someone like you who, who, who've been there and done it. Get, it's that much easier to get there again, do you think? Is it? I mean, because you, you believe because you've done it. Yeah, it seems that way yeah. <laughs> over the last four years, to be fair. But um, no, I think every, every game comes up with different challenges. And, um, you know, the, the manager now has got us uh, with one game at a time. So um, now the next game is Northampton. But like you said, uh, we've been on a good roll in the FA Cup. And, um, it's, but we, we wouldn't say that we prepare any differently for it mm. or whether the players raise their game because that's definitely not the case. But um, yeah, for the, for the last four years, we seem to have done well in it and uh, long may it continue. What about this crop for this season? It, it feels like you've, you've started well, you're scoring goals, scoring great goals. Um, how does this compare to, to previous sides you've played in? Um, I, th I just think from, from minute one in pre season, um, we've worked so hard in pre season. You know, the Gafford works really hard and, and that's paying. Um, you know, now we're playing to the way that we, we wanted to. Uh, we, we, like I said, we worked tremendously hard and we, um, we started off well. But, um, you know, we, we've got to keep going. We can't think we've cracked it or anything like that. We've got to keep working hard, um, taking it game by game and uh, seeing where it takes us. But like I said, we did work hard in pre-season and the, the gaffers instilled a, a real mentality that um, we must continue doing what we're doing. That's what we'll, we'll try and do. I know these days you don't line up next to them in a, in a tunnel. You sort of come out one, one by one, don't you? Um, but there'll be a few nerves in that group, won't they? Coming here on Monday night, the cameras are here because, because you know, people want to see an upset. Yeah, of course, yeah. So um, you know, I think when you what, been there before, where you play teams in the lower league, we went there to Royal Wooden Bass in mm. the previous round. So um, you know, coming here on a Monday night in front of the TV cameras is uh, it's going to be a different game for them as much as it, it will be for us. We'll try and make it as difficult as possible. Um, we'll give them the ultimate respect. They're, they're professional footballers, and you know, they've, they've done well over the years. But um, we, we've got to make sure we concentrate on ourselves and believe that we can cause an upset. And if, if because if we don't, there's no point playing any, any game of football. So um, that's what we'll be doing. I'm sure we'll be working on on a bit of the next couple of training sessions and, and trying to work out how we're going to go about it. But uh, we just got to continue doing what we've been doing. How do you think like the mon waiting till Monday night to play the game will affect you? Do you think will it be any different for you preparing for the game or not? Uh, well, it, it'll be different because you know we'll be training on Saturday instead of of playing, obviously. But um, you know, it's it's no different to a Tuesday night game. Um, you know, we, we the games on Monday night. We, we'll prepare as best as we can as a, as a part time team. So um, no, I think when 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 he ref blows a whistle for start of the game, you know, it's, it's another game of football under the lights at here. So um, no, I don't think that makes much difference. Um, I mean, there have been plenty of FA Cup memories the last few seasons. What I mean, what's your favourite? Like memory from the last four um, I think the Colstall win stands out. Um, that was a, that was a big win for the football club, and um, we, we weren't actually doing very well in the league at the time, and it was a it was a turning point for us. Um, so yeah, that was a, a really good victory, and, and obviously uh, heartache in the in the following round. But you know we, we 
last uh, two years ago at Tranmere as well. That was a, a good achievement for us, but um, obviously we couldn't hold on and, and we got beat here. But no, very fond memories over, over the last four years and um, hopefully we can create another one on Monday night. Mm. Um, now it would be a bit of a novelty as well in that the second round draw would have been made before the game's even been played. Will it be something you'll be looking at before the game or kind of try and keep it out of the head before until the final whistle? No, I'm pretty sure that we, um, I'm, I'm pretty sure we won't even know, to be honest with you. Um, you know, we, we'll be concentrating on the game um, that, we, we have, that we have to play and, and obviously after the game, if, if, if we get a good result, then, then we'll find out. But uh, to be honest, I don't think the players would, would be that bothered at, at that mm. point. Uh, we know we've got a really tough task against Northampton to try and get through, but um, so we'll be fully concentrated on that, I think. Yeah, and the final thing for me, um, obviously the game's going to be behind closed doors. Have you got anything you want to say to the fans who could be watching from home? Yeah, gut, gutted for them. Um, you know, I've been, it's my fourth year here now at the football club and um, without the biggest following, the fans that we do have are, are very loyal um, and they follow us home and away and, and, and I feel very uh, sorry that they're not here. Um, we'll, we'll be trying everything we can to, to get a win. Hopefully things change soon, but um, the main thing is, is that everyone stays safe and, and hopefully football you know, returns at, at some point. Um, soon, but you know we'll be we'll doing our best for the fans and hopefully create a, a good night. Thanks for that. Yeah, brilliant. Thank you very much. No worries. Cheers, Cheers chaps.